592 days since a meaningful game played in Pickering. Andrew Ballantyne in goal to face Cody Tyson in the Stobill Spirits. They're off to a bit of a rough start having lost five games in a row. Ryan Cutler down the wing with a solid chance that Ballantyne will push aside. Not the last time he'd face a one-on-one -on -one similar to that. Panthers' best chance of the opening 20 falls to Ethan Lindsay, who can't bang his shot home. But we do have a puck in the net in the first period. Garrett Lindbergh looks to have the game's first goal, but the skate of Ballantyne would knock the net off prior to the puck going in. So we go to the second period, still scoreless. Past the midway point of the game, Stovall in 2-1-1, but Brendan Tomlinson plays it perfectly, taking away the passing lane and blocking the shot to boot. It takes him to the 13th minute of the second, but we get our first goal. Alex Cunningham, quick pass for Lucas Rowe, and he's all alone and snaps the puck past Tyson, his third of the season and second against the Spirit. Stovall with a chance late in the period. A fallen Panther allows the Spirit to bust up. 2-1-1 on one to Carson Whitson. He's going to keep it and score. That goal comes shortly after Pickering managed to kill a long 5-on-3 shorthanded situation. So we are all square after 40 minutes. Nathan Tui looking to give the Spirit the lead, but Matthew Altamar troubles the shot and the end result an easy collection for Ballantyne. On the Spirit, 2-on-1 trailer for Kerwin. He rang it off the iron. Thomas West, the voice of the Panthers on fast hockey. That's how close we came to a winner at one end, but moments later. Into the middle, there's a shot. Block, rebound, scores! Under two and a half to go. Lucas LaPalm will seal the deal for Pickering. Row with the other, and Ballantyne with 31 saves. Panthers start with six on the road, but come away with eight points before the home opener to set a good tone. Recreation complex. You know, it was good. It's really hard to start off on the road. You know, you don't get this. You don't know the support of the fans and all that. So it was really good that we did get all those points at the start and then able to come here and get two as well. Uh, I felt good. Uh, starting off with the two breakaways really set the tone for me. And then just being able to carry off that energy and then continue on throughout the game. Yeah, it was, uh, it was a play down low, broken play. Uh, pickle went down and then uh, disturbed the de defense. I was lucky to pick it up, uh, give it to Lindsay. But really, I mean... It was my line mates that uh, started the play, and I was lucky enough just to put it in the net. I definitely uh, good to get back into the den, but a uh, couple of years ago, that team before uh, COVID shut everything down, that was definitely a great team. But definitely, uh, I think this year we have a really good chance of going far, seeing what we're capable of.